When we think about billionaires, we always imagine them taking their fortunes to the grave. But that's not always the case. We see now some of the richest billionaires who lost it all. Brilliant news! Number 1. Patricia Cluj She started working as a model. Later, she became insanely rich after her divorce with John Cluj, in which she got one billion dollars and another billion every year. In 1999, she started investing in vineyards in Albemarle, and everything worked out great. Until she tried to do the same thing in Cleveland and lost everything, having to sell her business to Donald Trump. 2. Sam Wiley He was a businessman and major contributor to conservative candidates, among other things. He had a net worth of $1.1 billion in 2006, but in 2014 was accused of tax evasion in too many offshore accounts, which drove him to complete bankruptcy. Him and his brother, who was also wrapped up in it all. 3. Adolf Merkel he was an entrepreneur and one of the richest people in Germany, developing Germany's largest pharmaceutical wholesaler, Phoenix Pharma Handel. In 2017, he owned $12.8 billion. However, his empire was difficult to maintain and he was losing a lot of money because of risky decisions. Until 2008, when he lost almost everything, leading him to commit suicide in 2009. 4. Sean Quinn he was a journalist and the richest person in Ireland in 2008 with 6 billion euros. However, he invested 2.8 billion euros of the family's wealth in the Anglo-Irish bank and took out a loan from the Golden Circle, which he never repaid. This resulted in his bankruptcy during the recession of 2011. He even spent nine weeks in jail in 2012 for asset stripping. 5. Alberto Villar he was an investment manager known as a patron of the arts and opera companies. He spent around $150 million in donations to art companies. In the year 2000, there was a crash in technology stocks where everything changed and he started losing his fortune. He was arrested in 2005 for security fraud and faced fines of more than $10 million and prison time of up to 155 years. 6. Ike Batista he is the chairman of the Brazilian conglomerate of EBX Group and serial entrepreneur who made a fortune in mining and oil and gas industries. In 2012, he had a net worth of $35 billion, but it didn't last long. In 2013, he only had $200 million due to his debts and his company's falling stock prices. Until in 2014, he was left with nothing. He became famous for being the fastest destroyer of wealth. 7. Jordan Belfort He is an author, motivational speaker and former stockbroker, although we all know him better as the original Wolf of Wall Street. He founded Stratton Oakmont, earning $250 million a year, in which he did a lot of pump and dump scams that led to 22 months of prison. 8. Anton Schlecker he is the founder and owner of the Schlecker drugstore chain in Germany. In 2003, he already had 6.5 billion euros, even after his kids were kidnapped in 1987, for which he paid a 10 million euro ransom. Schlecker and wife had to also pay 1 million euros each for fraud in the salaries of their employees. However, he only became bankrupt because of the company's competition in 2012. 9. Robert Allen Stanford Stanford was a financer and sponsor of professional sports with a net worth of $2 billion in 2012. But he made the big mistake of stealing $7 billion from investors. So now he is in jail serving a 110-year federal prison sentence and, of course, completely bankrupt. 10. Bjork Golver Glamenson 
He was the chairman and former owner of West Ham United and the majority owner and chairman of the Icelandic bank Landsbanki, one of the richest people in the world with a net worth of $1.1 billion. In 2008, he decided to take over Landsbanki's operations, replacing its board of directors, and that's when he lost everything, left only with a huge debt. If you were a billionaire, what would you spend all of your money on? Comment below.